up in Barney's room. Uh, I was, we used a landlady that I had in New York on 14th Street. And uh, <clears throat> she, you could, could only use little tiny 40-watt bulbs. I would go out once in a while and buy a 100-watt bulb, and she'd come in without even being announced and take that bulb and smash it. And she'd say, Edison is rich enough already, you know. And uh, there were some actors living on the top floor, cooking on a hot plate, which was forbidden. And one night, she was, they heard her coming up the stairs while they were making dinner, and they took the hot plate and shoved it into the bureau drawer and closed the drawer, and the whole place caught fire. We just used that on the, up in Barney's room on The Griffith Show. You didn't or did? Did, did. You did. Oh, it was a very good show. A friend of mine was... Uh, uh, working his way through medical school, and uh, he was working in a gas station, and a, a guy came in in a, a Packard Phaeton, a beautiful car, and he was supposed to pump grease into the steering column from below, and he couldn't get any grease to go in. He said to the manager, the grease won't go in, and the guy said, just force it, put the pressure up as high as you can and force it for 10 minutes. So he did. Now this guy comes in a white suit, picks up his car, and just as it goes over the curb to leave, uh, a snake of grease came out of the steering column, and the horn button stayed right on top of it, and it went out, and it stood there, and then flopped over on his white, white suit. And we did that in the Barney's car. How Barney, did you use that? Barney's first car. A lot of things, a lot of things. Uh, we had Barney's motorcycle. I, I bought a motorcycle for $4, a World War I motorcycle. And uh, I put it together and got it got it working, and, and, and uh, we used that motorcycle for Barney's motorcycle and hid some historical documents, fake historical documents, in, about its record in World War I.